Tulur, apa kabar? Uh, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be sharing you uh, where you can go to public library in Sydney, and I will divide it. Uh, uh, I will divide it into several parts in this channel. So I will be sharing you uh, public library in Circular Key area. It called um, Custom House Public Library. It is located just opposite uh, Circle Key train station. That one is Circle Key train station. And there are two platforms in this uh, train station. Platform 1 and 2. Um, platform, uh, and also there are several work in this uh, Circle Key as well. It's around 5 or 6 uh, work in this uh, Circle Key work. So, if you want to go to Manly, or Tarunggasu or you can uh, or another part for example like Watson Bay you can go to this uh, video Hi guys and also sorry and also uh, I will be sharing you how does it look like um, for the public library but I, I will not share in this video about how can you put, uh, you can use this wall or you can use this platform go and wear uh, but another video if I have chance I will share to you okay let's check out now you have to keep walking until uh, until McDonald's and you will pass McDonald's first here and you will see a custom house public library and that is the the building of the custom house public library just behind these trees and also this one is uh, like a cafe a small cafe here and also uh, in this building i will show you um, the public library inside how does it look like how it looks like inside this building so inside uh, this building custom house has um, fine dining restaurant and also public library Public library, custom house public library uh, has several levels in this building and it is located in Lotus Street here and it is just opposite the Circle Key train station. This one is Circle Key train station. Now we have arrived in uh, Circle Key public library. It is called um, Custom House Public Library. So let's we go inside. So it, basically, inside the public library here, we have to keep silent or in a low voice. So we have to respect other people who use this public library as well. This is the main entrance for uh, Custom House Public Library and this is the history, history of the Custom House. This is the story, the journey of the Custom House. So um, in the history, this building is like a post office so you you can uh, ship your news as well in here and then you can uh, you can deliver to other people use this custom house and this is the, the story And also there is like a relationship between this custom house and the Chinese. And also this, there are several signs in here. It's an information board in here. 
So this is the custom house, the level G or ground floor as a custom house concierge and also the visitor services. After our library returns, Young Alfred and Kue Bar. So even though um, this public library had uh, already closed, you can use the ground floor until this building totally is uh, shut, um, totally closed for the day. And level one is a library, exhibition and partner long room. And second level has a library as well. So two levels for library. Level four, it's a gem venture and private equity. And the top level has like a cafe or fine dining restaurant. And this is the directory. If you want to uh, read a newspaper, you can uh, go to the ground level. And if you want to get some information about the library, you can go to level 1. For example, if you want to, uh, to create a membership for this uh, City of Sydney li uh, Public Library, you can go to level 1 and meet one of the staff there. And you pay nothing for the membership. It means free for membership. And also, um, for the level two, there there is a library information. So if you seek some books, a particular books, and if if you couldn't find it, you can ask the the guys in li library information either in, in level one or in level two okay now we are going inside to the public library and this is the ground floor if you want to go uh, if you want to read the newspaper magazine you can go to newspaper room here lots of newspaper here And if you want to read some books or magazine, you can use this area as well. It's very convenient to read because lots of uh, comfort cushion in here. That one is still library level 1 and that one is library level 2. So, if you want to have like a study room, you can go to level 2 here, but on the another side. So, this fully building, it's uh, for two levels for public library. That one is still public library around here, and also this one is around here. So, there, there is like a reading room is just over here. Here, so you can go by up, uh, by stairs or by lift. There is a lift here uh, in in this building. So that is uh, like a quiet reading room. If you if you want to go inside this uh, reading room, you have to put your low voice if you want to have a chat with other people and with your friends as well. And also if you want to. Um, to have a quiet room for study, if you are studying in Sydney, you can use this room, either that room or that room. And I think there is a uh, um, like a kitty kitty's room for for children for um, for reading. But I don't remember because it was long time ago. I I went here around like three years ago or four years ago so that one has like a computer but I don't know now maybe it has changed so in here 
it was like a computer free to use for everyone free to use for internet and also if you want to um, if you want to seek some information for the particular books you can go either that this level is there is like a computer section up here on level 2 uh, there are like three computer I think three around three computer Excellent. you can seek the book the book title in this computer and you will see you will find the shelf where the shelf is or if you can if you are confused uh, if you confuse how to use that uh, online catalog you can ask on that desk and on that desk there's that one the library desk information desk also just behind that computer okay and also this library it's opens starts from 10 a.m. so now it's like a around 15 minutes more it, it will open I will wait because I need a particular books in uh, from this public library okay please stay tuned if you are visiting Sydney uh, and if you are in this building in this uh, custom house you can get some information from this uh, information desk there are several um, information from this one there, there are like a Sydney guide where you can go it's a English edition and also this one is um, the map for Sydney and also if you are Chinese you can use this this Chinese Chongwen this one is a Chongwen this one is um, for Japanese and Korean and also if you want to uh, use the train you can use uh, this map it will show you it will direct you where you can go and also uh, Sydney uh, will have some events for example Vivid Sydney it is held uh, it is held uh, between 25 May until 16 June this year Vivid Sydney is like a um, the light projector on the building so it, it will play some some story some lights uh, in in this building it's opera house and another building is this building uh, custom house and Vivid Sydney will be held uh, in Darling Harbour as well and uh, Sydney Harbour Bridge so and if you want to know the events in Sydney you can use this one yeah, for example if you want to go Sydney you can discover Sydney what what you can visit and also for example in this May, what will be uh, what will be happening in Sydney? So there is like an um, electric vehicle expo and another one wings over Illawarra, or maybe um, like Sibit. Sibit is very uh, famous in Sydney, Australia. Sibit is like a IT exhibition and also there is arts in here and another one you can see from April to the October maybe December for a year for a half year more than half year here so what 
happens in June, what happens in July, August, September, October, November, and December. So, in this events calendar, it will bring you um, the the most famous uh, tourism spot, uh, some tourism spot in Sydney. You can go, for example, in this regional, not in this uh, Sydney CPD or sub Sydney suburb. You can go to like uh, Outback, where you can go to uh, for your Outback, and you can go to Blue Mountain. It's very very famous, very famous for tourists go to Blue Mountain, and also Snowy Mountain in this New South Wales regional, and also what. What you can go, uh, where where you can go, what what you will find in South Coast and Central Coast and Hunter Valley. So Hunter Valley, this one has like a very uh, fine wine. You can you can find some wine in here, red wine and white wine in here. So you can. Have a look from this website as well. You can go to sydney.com or visit newsoutwells.com. If you open um, this catalog, uh, Sydney Airport Train, you will find um, the the train network here. We are in here, Circle Key. And we we just came from this area to here. And as I said before, there are two platform. Platform one goes to Vineyard Town Hall and Central, and you can change from Central to another platform to another suburb. I will not show you uh, how you can use this uh, this train from train station. So another platform is is uh, is uh, platform two. It's from Circle Key, it goes to St. James Museum and Central. And from Central, you can uh, change to another platform, goes to this suburb or to this suburb. Okay. If you, for example, if you want to go to Bondi Junction from this Circle Key, you can go to Vineyard Town Hall first. And from Town Hall, you can change to another platform. I think it's platform five or six. It, it will go to um, Martin Place, then King's Cross, it's Cliff, and Bondi Junction. It's through here, Bondi Junction. Okay. And you, what you can find, you can go to Airport Link. Dot com dot au uh, for using uh, for um, to get some information for airport train and also you can use trip view I will show you later on and this is another timetable that you will you will uh, plan your plan ahead for your trip this is the timetable for weekdays and weekends public holiday and in trip view you will see this map as well this is the train network across Sydney and Sydney suburb it includes uh, North, North Shore of uh, Sydney West Western Sydney suburb, Eastern suburb, South sub, Southern suburb. I will show you later on. Or you can plan ahead using uh, transport nsw.info or 131500.com.au. If you are 
visiting custom house, you will find this project underneath uh, the, these tiles. It's a city view for Sydney C CPD. And it is created by custom house Creative Sydney City, the city of Sydney Council. And this is the custom house that I already showed you before. And this is the city view underneath this floor. This is the whole Sydney CPD looks like. This is the Sydney Opera House in Panelong Point. There is a Sydney Opera House, and we are just here. It's a circle key in here, and custom house is just opposite here. If you want to go to um, Darling Harbour, you can walk around this area, and then if you find like a hotel for season you can that one around here the tall brown building there is a four season and you can go turn left around this area through George Street here this one is George Street um, George Street around here and you can go to Turn right over here. This one is like a market market street. This one market street, and you will walk down. This one is Sterling Harbour area. So this one is Sterling Harbour area. This is the wharf for Sterling Harbour, and this is King Street wharf in here. King Street wharf. This one is uh, a new a new um, wharf called Barangaru area and also this is still Darling Harbour area this is Darling Harbour area it is called like Tumbalong Park Tumbalong Park and Darling Quarter Darling Quarter is this building I, I can't show you in the in here because it's blurry glass in here but if you walk by yourself in here you can see this one uh, somehow it's clear and that one is uh, ICC Sydney International International Convention Center this one oh sorry International Convention Center is this one this one uh, this one international convention center so from here to here is international convention center Sydney and if you walk down to the south of Sydney if you keep going through the George Street George Street is this one is George Street you will see um, after town hall is uh, Chinese market is this one it's quite popular it's a tourist uh, tourist destination it's a Chinatown here by this market and also if this is the central station train station central train station and also if you go around another side you will see um, Hyde Park is this one that one is Hyde Park it's quite big from here to here it's Hyde Park and that one is St. Mary Cathedral 
or SMC Catholic Church, Saint Mary Cathedral Catholic Church, on this uh, just opposite the Hyde Park, on the north north side of Hyde Park. Okay, um, what else I can show you? And that one is the iconic of Sydney. It's a Sydney Tower. This one is the Sydney Tower. And another one is uh, if you go outside from Custom House or if you get off from the Circle Key train station, keep going to the left here. You will see this is the Sydney Harbour Bridge. Cross the bridge here. This is the Sydney Harbour Bridge. And if you go to on the, around this this side is a Luna Park. You can bring your children place there. This is the Sydney Opera House in Panelong Point. There is a Sydney Opera House, and we are just here. It's a circle key in here, and Custom House is just op opposite here. If you want to go to um, Darling Harbour, you can walk around this area, and then if you find like a hotel. For season, you can get one around here. The tall brown building there is a four season, and you can go turn left around this area through George Street here. This one is George Street, um, George Street around here, and you can go to. Turn right over here. This one is like a market, market street. This one market street, and you will walk down. This one is Darling Harbour area. So this one is Darling Harbour area. This is the wharf for Darling Harbour, and this is King Street wharf in here. King Street wharf. This one is uh, a new. A new um, wharf called Barangaru area, and also this is still Darling Harbour area. This is Darling Harbour area. It is called like Tumbalong Park, Tumbalong Park, and Darling Quarter. Darling Quarter is this building. I I can't show you in the in here because it's blurry glass in here but if you walk by yourself in here you can see this one uh, somehow it's clear and that one is uh, ICC Sydney International International Convention Center this one oh sorry International Convention Center is this one this one, this one, International Convention Center. So from here to here is International Convention Center, Sydney. And if you walk down to the south of Sydney, if you keep going through the George Street, George Street is this one is George Street. You will see. Um, after town hall is uh, Chinese market is this one it's quite popular it's a tourist uh, tourist destination it's a Chinatown here by this market and also it, this is the central station train station central train station and also if you go around another side you will see um, Hyde Park is this one.
that one is Hyde Park. It's quite big from here to here. It's Hyde Park. And that one is St. Mary Cathedral or SMC Catholic Church. St. Mary Cathedral Catholic Church on this uh, just opposite the Hyde Park on the north, north side of Hyde Park. Okay, um, what else I can show you? And that one is the iconic of Sydney. It's a Sydney Tower. This one is the Sydney Tower. And another one is uh, if you go outside from Custom House or if you get off from the Circle Key train station, keep going to the left here, you will see this is the Sydney Harbour Bridge. Cross the bridge here. This is the Sydney Harbour Bridge. And if you go to around this this side is a Luna Park. You can bring your children place there. So this is the stairs to Custom House level one and two, or you can go by this lift level one and two. So I will show you uh, using a lift, and hopefully I can share it to you how does uh, how it look looks like inside level 1 and 2 in this custom house uh, public library this is level 1 for custom house public library and this is for printing all the bookshelf here and the uh, exhibition, uh, the photography here. And this is for kiddos. This is level 1 for Custom House Public Library. They changed already. There is no computer in this area. This is the only the photography here. It was um, some computer in here, but uh, it has changed. And this is the stairs if you want to go out. We are, we are in ground floor right now and back to the entrance or exit door here
so let me try on this shelf what number is this level 2 three six three five five no guys this is my uh, the end of my story story uh, for today this is my adventure experience so if you like uh, this video you can subscribe here here or even here there is a button this one button for subscribe and also you can like this video as well and don't forget to share with your friend so this one is the button for like the, this video so the pr purpose for subscribe you will not miss for for your next adventure experience i always udah subscribe belum kalau belum subscribe di sini ya ini ada buttonnya atau di sini ada tombol button uh, ada ada simbol subscribe oke okay. have a nice day and see you next time